In this video, I'm going to be sharing with you my favorite little blitzing concept out of the Nikko 335 Odd. And honestly, it's probably the best blitzing concept in Madden 22. And I want to illustrate this more as a concept than just a money play or money blitz. So we're going to dive right into the video. If you want to get my full Nickel 335 Odd defensive guide, I'm going to put a link to that in the description of this video. You can get that for just 15 bucks, and it's the best defense of the game. It gives you the best chance of getting stops this year, in my opinion, um, for not just the coverage that we can create behind it, but also the pressure that we can create as well. So if you want to get that, there's a link in the description. All right, guys, so I'm going to come out in any play. It doesn't have to be cover sync. It doesn't have to be cover one Robert Press. It doesn't have to be any of these plays, but I'm going to come out in any play in this formation that has the four-man uh, pressure, like the four-down lineman blitzing. You honestly don't even need to necessarily even worry about that because the setup's going to be the same whether they're blitzing or not blitzing. So all that to say, I'm just going to come out and cover six. And uh, what we're going to do is we're going to spread the defensive line. We're going to spread the linebackers. And then we're just simply going to crash the defensive line to the right. As you can see here, this is the pressure. This is the angle that we want. As you look right here real closely, you see that these blitz angles are kind of stacking on top of each other. That's really the secret sauce of this pressure. So I'm just going to kind of user my guy. And honestly, just to show this concept, I'm just going to user this safety um, to show you that you don't even have to hover over the line of scrimmage, which I really like that about this pressure. So as you'll see there, and that time the running back kind of held me up. But let me put the running back on like a wheel route just to kind of show the pressure a little bit. We'll show that setup again. Spread line, spread linebackers, and then all you're going to do is just crash your line. Uh, to the right side and what you're gonna see is you're gonna get instant heat at the quarterback so the cool part of and the beauty of this is that we can actually do this um, we can really do this I think very very well from 335 odd and one of the little secrets of this is that what we can also do is man up the running back so for example if the running back blocks and we man him up you're gonna see here that the running back we can sometimes kind of pull him out right there we weren't able to but occasionally you'll be able to pull that running back out a lot of it has determined um, with where you stand and we go over some of that stuff in the defensive ebook but you'll see here another little trick that we can do is this blitz angle right here if I were to blitz this linebacker you're gonna see that this is gonna actually trigger the running back so this is a five-man pressure but the running back's gonna be blocking, and you're gonna see here that the running back's gonna come inside, and as you see, we're able to get the pressure at the quarterback. So not only are we gonna be able to do this with only sending five, but we can actually do this by, and this is a really good bunch defense in my opinion, because what we can do is we can go ahead and QB spy uh, Vita Vea, and we can drop this guy on the right into a hard flat. So we got really good coverage on this bunch side, and then the biggest thing we have to do is just watch. If the running back goes out on a route, then we're gonna go to him. If he doesn't, then I'm able to kind of have a lot of freedom with my user. So typically I like to actually use her, this guy, especially against Gun Bunch. And if the running back goes out on a route, I'm gonna go guard him. If not, I'm gonna just stay, you know, kind of the course here. And then I'll typically just play man lock on that outside receiver. So you'll see here, this is kind of what the defense looks like. And you'll see, oh, the running back blocked. And as you can see, we're completely screaming, only sending three people. So. This, in my opinion, is really truly the best blitzing concept in the game this year. It's very effective against three three or a bunch. It's also very effective against other formations as well. But I think it's the best, in my opinion, against gun bunch because we can really kind of trigger this running back to kind of glitch out. And some people have asked me, is the two four five odd better than the three three five odd? And in my opinion, right now the answer would be no to that. I know a lot of pros are using the two four five odd, but I find that the three three five odd gives you the most consistency on both sides for the pressure, and it also does the best job against the blocked running back as well. So uh, I would encourage you to stick with the three three five odd if you want to get my full three three five odd defensive guide. I'm going to put a link to that in the description of this video. And also, if you're new to the channel, be sure to subscribe. We upload videos every single day that can help you get better at this game. And if you want to get my full defensive guide, there's a link to my website in the description description you'll be able to pick, click that link and head over to the website you'll be able to get that guide within five minutes of clicking that link so thanks for your time thanks for your support hope you enjoyed the video and if you want to get that guide there's a link in the description